Hello, welcome to Android application development tutorials. This is a series of tutorials. In this tutorial lessons, we will be starting from small applications to larger applications. Please follow all the lessons and try it out. In this lesson, we will be seeing one of the method to use a button. When we click on a button, how to perform the activity. So the button click listener we will be implementing in this project. Create an Android project. Give a suitable name. I am giving btn click one because we have three more different methods to use the button. So I am giving one method here in this tutorial and after giving the project name click next. Choose the build target. Next you can give the package name here. And if you wish change the name of the activity and finish the project. Find your package from the package explorer and open the main.java file from the src folder under the package and main.xml under the layout folder under resource. So this is our main and we have the xml layout here. Delete the default component. We are going to add a button and one large text as well. Verify the name of the button. It will be button1 and large text by default the name is given as text view. So we are using only these two components here. Save. Move to main.java. We can initialize the objects for the button and the text view. I am giving the name for the button object is button1 and for the text view I am going to use the name tv1. As for the button and text view are automatically imported into the project. Now we have to connect or initialize the button1 and tv1 into the GUI resource components this button and the large text. We are going to initialize it by btn1 equal to find view by id r dot id dot button1 button1 is the component in resource definition there is an error showing here we have to give a type casting so we have to type cast it into button type Similarly, we have to do the same thing for the text view one also. Text view one equal to find view by id r dot id dot text view one. Again, in your texting, typecast into into the type of text view one. So both the components are indicated with the GUI design and we have to give the on click listener functionality for this btn1 object for that we have to implement on click listener and there is an error showing there add any unimplemented methods when we go for the on click listener we have to implement on click method that's what it was showing error and we are really going to use this method to set some text when we click on the button so we can use it by tv1 dot set text and we can give the text here
implemented with on click listener now it is done when the object is created we have initialized these two objects of this button and text view when the object of the main is created main object is an extension of this activity and which is having the additional functionality implemented from the click listener to have the functionality for on click so we have the functionality enabled here for this button for that we have to btn1 dot set on click listener this we have to say this on click listener functionality will be go to which component either to tv1 or btn1 or something else we are sending it to this btn1 so if the user is clicking on the btn1 on click listener will handle it and it will be passed to this method on click and the procedure which we have given within the on click functionality will be executed save it and run the object as an android application we have the button and the large text on the screen when you click the button implemented with on click listener this is the text which we have given here so this way we can implement an action for the button when an action is performed on a button in an activity we can do some process by enabling the button with a click listener thank you for watching this video if you like the video please don't forget to click like please subscribe the channel i will be uploading more videos and please post your valuable comments on the channel page wish you a wonderful and successful day bye